the story behind David, you know, if David if David had stayed alive, we'd have a territory right here to this very day. We'd we'd be we'd be working instead of doing this right here. And he had the title and seven he, days before he he passed in Jamaica. Uh, he right? yeah. According to uh, Rick Flair's book, he says that. Uh, uh, Bruiser Brody uh, found the body and removed some evidence in the room. Bruiser Brody, okay. Uh, what, that, what happened was David, he liked quaaludes, okay? Way for, way for things about that very ground. He would take and break them into four quarters. And after he'd wrestle, he would take one because it was, brother, it, it was pain. We had a lot of pain. Yeah. And we was always looking for something to kill the pain. Well, he would get them, break in a quor little quarter, okay? Take it and then drink Jack Daniels or Crown Royal or 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 whatever he could get his hands on, whiskey wise. That's what and that's what he done. Well, he got over he got over there. He snuck them in somehow. No, I don't know how. I, I, who knows? But he got them in, okay. And then he he couldn't find no. It was late. He rat went and wrestled. Come back was going to have, like he does in the United States. He had broke one off, put it in. Couldn't find no whiskey, so he got socky. He go down to the corner thing, drop three, four hundred yang in a in a coke machine looking deal, and you get three liters of sake if you want it. You know, yeah. sake is like a hundred times stronger than anything we got. Yeah. He he started drinking the dead gum sake. It went and mixed with that, and it and it blew up. Now that you know, the, they said he had a gastric blew up or gastric blew up or something. But, and then Frank went in there and, and flushed all the, cause he did, Frank was working for Fritz. I can't, I can't, I, I, I can't remember for sure if I was over there, but I, I remember, I, what I remember about it is Fritz let him stay in the room for like two weeks before he could get his butt over there. And it takes like 24 hours to fly over there. And then 24 hours to fly back. What, whatever the reasons, they the, the Japs turned the AC off in the room. David swooped up three times its size because it was like 145, 50 degrees, and it's dead summer, hotter than it is here. And now we're in Texas. But anyway, if 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 like I say, if that would have, if that would have, if David would have lived, we would we would we would be doing. We would have territory right here. I know we would. Yeah. But uh, that didn't happen. And then uh, for for uh, this is this is what I found out about. And I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna tell this story. You can uh, at Russell Cave. First night I was there, we went down out of the, out of the motel room down to have pizza with uh, Johnny Mantel and Kay and. And Kevin Sullivan was there. Where he's an old time friend. The the dude uh, Mike, the uh, muscle building dude. Uh, anyway, Johnny Mantell says he wants to tell me a story, and I said, "What is this story about?" He says, it's "About Channel 11 and Channel 26 and the Superstation." I said, "Well, the Superstation is TBS." He said, I'm talking about 15 years before that, when David was, when David was, David had just died, okay? Fritz had a meeting with Channel 11 and Channel 26 to become the superstation worldwide, worldwide. With, okay, if this would happen, uh, Fritz would have been the Vince McMahon right now, or his family would have been. You understand know what I'm saying? The, uh, the, uh, they had the meeting to make a superstation, but Dave had just died, okay? When Dave died, yeah. he come in that, he had that meeting. He come back out of that meeting, of course, Bronco Lubitsch, Akbar, uh, uh, David, David Manning was there. And Fritz turns around and looks at him and says, "My two boys, they can't, they they can't go worldwide. They can go statewide. They may be able to go nationwide, but they can't go worldwide. They can't handle it. No, the answer is no. Go tell them no. That was the end of it. Shot down the tubes. If that would have happened, if Fritz had said one word, 
Yes. And Dave had lived. It would be this 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 Dallas would be Connecticut uh, of, of, of professional wrestling right now. Right now. Yeah. Right now. Right now. Right now. If that if it was one word, no, yes. Instead of saying no, say yes. He didn't do it because he he, he did not think that his boys could go nationwide. 